When Union General William Tecumseh Sherman reported on his capture of Atlanta, Georgia in 1864, he listed the number of prisoners that the Union had taken as well as the casualties that the Confederate armies had suffered. He closed by saying, if that is not success, I don't know what is. Someone who is visiting Atlanta now, a metro area of nearly six million people, home to international corporations and movie sets, might be tempted to say the same thing. While Atlanta is not only a city that thrives on business, the city that Sherman lit on fire during the Civil War has thrived after its rebuild. It is a fast-growing city with a diverse population that casts a big shadow nationally and globally. No matter what your interests are, there is something for everyone to enjoy in the city of Atlanta. The state of Georgia was one of the original 13 colonies of the United States when the British settled on the land. But the city of Atlanta wasn't actually founded until the, 19, or the 1840s. Despite that, it is rich in its history. Atlanta was home to Margaret Mitchell, the author of Gone with the Wind, and her home is a shrine to readers from around the world. Atlanta is also home to many locations that were important to the civil rights movement of the 1960s. This city is not only home to Sweet Auburn, the neighborhood where Martin Luther King Jr. grew up, but it also has the church both he and his father were pastors at, as well as his birthplace. This is also the only city in the United States that has two Nobel Prizes on public display, King's and former President Jimmy Carter's. Since 1996, Atlanta has also been home to the, Atlantic, the Atlanta Olympic Centennial Park, where a bombing occurred in 1996 while the city was hosting the Summer Olympic Games. As Atlanta's population and size is on the rise, the diversity will only create more history and culture, allowing the people to thrive and giving them more to celebrate. While Atlanta is a city full of people with a diverse history and unique and timely experience, it is also a city that holds many artistic and cultural experiences. There is the Contemporary Art Center, which is an art museum that people can visit for free with exhibits from local artists, as well as modern art and photography from around the world. It is home to the High Museum of Art, which, doesn't, which has contemporary design exhibits, as well as photography, painting, and sculptures. But it doesn't have just visual art. Atlanta also has many performing arts centers, such as the historic Fox Theater, which hosts not only Broadway and off-Broadway musicals and plays, but recording artists like Paramore and Bonnie Vare. As the population of Atlanta grows, it also has become on par with New York, Los Angeles, and Chicago as far as it being contracted by many production companies for TV and movie sets. Large production companies like Marvel, FX, and Netflix use the city to film movies such as Spider-Man Homecoming, Baby Driver, and Black Panther, and popular TV series like Atlanta, Stranger Things, and the AMC's The Walking Dead. As well as the historical value the city of Atlanta holds and all of the artistic aspects of Georgia's capital city, it is a large town with many other points of interest to offer to anyone who would visit. Atlanta is home to natural landmarks such as the Botanical Gardens, Piedmont Park, and Stone Mountain. Atlanta History Center preserves the culture of the Old South, the African American community, and the pioneers. Downtown Atlanta hosts several celebrations and festivals that encourage the participation of tourists as well as the locals. These things include the LGBT Annual Pride Parade and festivals like Midtown Music, which has attracted artists like Dua Lipa, Mumford & Sons, and Tove Lu in its 2017 lineup. It also has the Shaking Knees Festival, which not only included artists like Portugal the Man, Saint Motel, and the 20th, but is also sponsored by businesses and restaurants in the Atlanta area to encourage people to sample food and shop there as well as stay for longer. And for people who don't find history or art that interesting, Atlanta is also the scene of several locations with reports of paranormal activity, like Civil War battlegrounds and cemeteries, as well as houses with stories of supernatural instances. With the rising interest that people have in all of the art, business, culture, history, and opportunity that Atlanta has as a town, its population is growing and the things to do are increasing with the amount of people that arrive and decide to stay. The makeup of Atlanta is growing and changing, and with all the changes come more opportunities for fun. 
These changes make it easier for people to come to the city and enjoy their stay no matter the experiences that they've had. The diverse opportunities that Atlanta has to offer help make sure that anyone can enjoy their stay in the city.